Namaste guys and welcome to our seventh video in our Vim tutorial series and in this video we'll take a look at Vim's visual mode. Okay, so I'm going to quickly open up the Python file we were looking at before and turn on the colors. Um, so I'll just quickly demonstrate what visual mode looks like in Vim. So you could do things like uh, things like this if you wanted to uh, highlight a certain part of the file, right? And once you've highlighted uh, this particular section, um, then you can issue other operators that you want. Like you could hit D to delete um, that selection, or you could have typed Y to yank that, or whatever that we, we have looked at so far, right? So there are three different types of selection that you can do in Vim, in visual mode. Uh, first of all, to do this, you need to be in normal mode. So hit escape if you're in insert mode. And uh, uh, the first type of visual mode we'll look at is uh, visible word, right? So you hit V, uh, lowercase v, then you get to the visual mode as you can see from here, okay? And while in visual mode, you can use your arrow keys uh, if you're not feeling very, uh, uh, if you're not feeling vim, or you could use JKL keys too. Make a selection right um, and you could also use other motion commands like word w and you could hit b and you could also do 10j to go down and uh, you could select whatever um, text you want okay so uh, this is lowercase v it lets you uh, select half half of the lines or it even lets you select a single word um, and it has a lot of flexibility that way, okay? And uh, um, the second type of, and if you want to exit from visual mode at any point because you're confused or you want to do it all over again, then you can simply hit escape, okay? And when you hit escape, you go back to normal mode, okay? So normal mode is where you, um, is your like missing control and you go to other modes from normal mode and then come back to normal mode, right? You hit I to go to insert mode, do your changes, come back to normal mode, and um, save the file or whatever and you do v to go to the visual mode select something and issue your command and come back to normal mode right so we looked at small v and if you issue capital v while you're in normal mode then you go into visual line mode right so it, this is also visual mode but um, in in this uh, uh, the selection are in line basis so you can only select lines. There's no way to select half a line or select a word. Okay, okay cool. Uh, this is the second type of mm, visual selection. And I hit escape again to go to normal mode. So the third type of visual selection that uh, I want to show you guys is uh, visual block. To do that, you need to hit control V. Okay, and as you can see over here, it says visual block. You're in visual block mode. And what this lets you do is uh, things like, so if I hit, uh, if I select this word, and if I go down, then it doesn't select the entire line and come to the next line, but it selects, um, uh, it selects like a rectangle, it selects like a um, quadrilateral, right? So you can do interesting things like, so I've, I've selected um, uh, my four tokens and maybe I want to change them. I want to delete them, I could have hit D or I could even hit things like G and tilde to change cases in Vim. Okay, that's a command in Vim. G tilde uh, will change the cases of uh, your, your selection or your, um, um, your um, part of text that you want to, want to operate it on. Okay, great. So those are the three types of visual mode. Now, what can you do with after selecting with visual mode? So we've already looked at changing cases. You could also do things like, um, so you, you want to delete a certain part of this line, then what I would do is I'd hit V and I'd go, um, I'd go word, word until I find uh, what, you, what I want to get rid of. And then I would hit D to delete that. And I would type in uh, the new token, okay? Uh, in this particular case, you could have also done the same thing with CW and then typed in your new token, but uh, you can uh, like I can easily imagine situations where that would not be the case. Uh, and if I want to 
uh, move these two lines to bottom then I would hit capital V and select these two lines and I'll, do, I'll press D to delete that and I'll go to where I want to paste this and hit P and I suddenly um, copy pasted multiple lines using both visual mode and copy paste commands we looked at in the previous video. Alright, so that is the basics of visual mode. So you have three different types. First is visual mode, which lets you select by words and also across lines. And then there's visual line, which only lets you select lines. And then there's visual block, which will let you um, create uh, correlaterals uh, like so. Okay, great. That's it for this video, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.